Welcome, I'm Joshi, and in this playthrough of Marvel Champions, we have Hulk versus Venom in standard difficulty. We're doing Hulk in leadership. Uh, our aim is just to sort of have allies in the control threat while Hulk will just do all the punching. Uh, let's hope it goes well. We'll go through our setup here. We have Leave Us Alone. We put the Bell Tower environment uh, into play quiet side face up, which is here. So if there are three chime counters here, we flip this card. Has an interrupt where any amount of damage will be dealt to Venom by an attack. You may place that ch many chime counters here instead. Uh, Venom himself, he has a scheme of one, attack of two, health 17. He comes in with toughness. And he has a forced response after you attack and damage Venom with a card you control. Place one face down boost card on your identity. So that's been clarified to when you or an ally attacks and damages Venom. We place one face down boost card on our identity. Moving to stage 1B. Uh, we have the Leave Us Alone. Comes in with two uh, threat to begin with, goes up one, uh, start a villain phase each round. We have a force interrupt. When Venom activates against you, move each face down boost card from your identity to Venom. So, with that all set up, let's uh, drop a hand size. So, an unstoppable force, make the call, Ant Man, limitless strength, and strength in numbers. Um, I'm going to hold on to limitless strength and Ant Man. I'm going to mulligan these three. And we have Strength, Unstoppable Force, and a Hulk Smash. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. Because I'm pretty happy with this. We're going to flip up into Hulk. We're going to use our Limitless Strength. The Hulk Smash, the 13, we're not going to do it to Venom. Um, so because we have amount of damage we dealt to him, so it's not it takes. So we're going to throw it all onto the... Uh, bell Tower, taking that to 13, which will flip it to its loud side. So on the ringing side, we increase all damage to Venom takes by one. If there's no chime counters here, we flip this card and has a force interrupt. When Venom attack would deal, when Venom's attack would deal any amount of damage to an identity, remove that many chime counters from here for each chime counter removed, prevent one of that damage. Uh, we are then going to Spend three resources to bring in Ant Man. So, when Ant Man hits play, we place one PIM counter on him to a maximum of four for each resource you have paid for him. So, we paid for him with three, so he's going to have three counters on him. And he gets one hit point, so he's got three hit points. We will then thwart with Ant Man for two. We'll take a consequential. And that'll be us rule ready up. Draw four cards, rapid response, make the call, power of leadership, give me something, make the call, that's terrible hand. <laughs> um, yeah, okay. All right. One threat goes in the main scheme. Venom is going to attack us for two plus nothing, so he takes two chime counters off here. Get our encounter card. We have now we are angry. Uh, so again, plus my attack. It comes in with two rage counters. Venom's attacks gain overkill. Uh, after Venom takes any amount of damage from attack, remove one rage counter from here. Where is my little reminder? Overkill. Okay, uh, we will attack with Hulk to knock off the tough. So we didn't actually, Venom didn't take damage from an attack, so that we don't get the uh, encounter card. Ant-Man will hang out because we'll keep him around for thwarting. We're going to flip down. We're going to use our experimental research to draw a card, discard a card. Squirrel Girl, great, brilliant. Um, we'll throw away and make the call. We'll do a power of leadership to play Squirrel Girl. So after Squirrel Girl is played, deal one damage to each enemy. So that's not uh, an attack. So it's just going to be the one damage to Venom there, which after it takes damage from an attack. So that's going to do nothing there. Still got no allies here. 
Can't do anything with rapid response. So we are actually going to mulligan these two cards. Oh, but Squirrel Girl will thwart for one while she's down here. Then we're ready. We'll draw five cards. We have a movable object, Maria Hill, Thunderclap, Thunderclap, and Mockingbird. Yep, one threat in the main scheme. Venom is going to scheme for one plus two, so three. Get our encounter card. Uh, this will gain Surge. And this also gains Surge. Run Revealed. Venom activates against you. Each boost card turned face up during this activation gets plus one boost. Alright, so he's scheming again for one plus. So one plus, so that's going to be doubled, so that's going to be three all up. That's not great. So now we're at eight on that. But we can do some tricks, hopefully. We will experimental research to draw a card, discard a card, a suborbital leap. Throw away a thunderclap. Not gonna, definitely not going to play two of those. But we are going to spend two resources to bring in Maria Hill. After she ends play, each player draws one card. Okay. We're going to spend three resources to bring in a movable object, giving us four hit points, and retaliate. Now, we're going to flip up to Hulk. We're going to attack Venom, increases damage he takes by... Oh, all damage he takes by one. So when that was dealt... Sorry. Deal one damage. Yeah, sorry. Venom should have taken two damage earlier. But now Hulk's attacking for three. Plus the one from the bell tower. Taking Venom down to 11. Ant-Man thwarts for two. Maria thwarts for two. Squirrel Girl will also thwart for one and get knocked out. Oh, and when we attacked Venom and took damage, we move one rage counter from him. And with that, we will ready. Get four cards. We have Honorary Avenger, Suborbital Leap. Strength in numbers and power of leadership. One threat at the main scheme. Venom is going to attack us for three plus four. It's going to take four off here. Oh wait, sorry, we attacked him, so he should have he should have got the boost card, so four. Still would have been four. Can we get our encounter card. Villain schemes. So scheme for one plus. You are stunned. If you're already stunned, you'll know. So just the one, and we get stunned. Oh, sorry. And we also, when he no, because he didn't deal damage to us, we don't get the retaliate, I'm guessing. Um, hmm. We'll attack to remove our stun. Here comes Mixie. And I'm actually thinking we're going to strengthen numbers, exhaust these two, and draw two more cards. A crushing Blow, and Honorary Avenger. So what we'll do now, is we'll spend three resources, which will be all physical for sub order Leap. Remove three threat for the scheme, five threat instead of use a physical, which we did. So we'll take all the threat off here. And then we'll throw an Honorary Avenger onto Ant-Man. 
give him an extra hit point. And we're ready. Get four cards. Of a crushing blow. Hulk smash. Banner's lab. And energy. Oh, mix. Uh, villain's turn. One threat on the main scheme. Uh, Venom is going to attack us for three. Mixie's clearly knocked the cards. So three plus one is four. So he's going to take four off here. Bring that down to three. Then we get our counter card. Of whom the bell tolls, remove two chime counters from the bell tower. Uh, if it's on its quiet side, we take one damage. If it's on its ring side, remove one threat from the main scheme. Nice. Okay. We'll spend three resources to Hulk Smash. Spend for 13, be 14 because of that. So that'll take this out. Also means we lose the now angry because we just did another damage to him. Pushing him to stage two. So he comes in with tough again. Uh, when revealed, we search the encounter deck and discard pile for tooth and nail side scheme and uh, put it into play. Doesn't come out, so let's find it. There it is. It's going to give us a hazard icon. Comes with eight threat, and Artvan takes any amount of damage from an attack, remove an equal amount of threat from here. Five, six, seven, eight. Uh, oh, he's also steady now. And still the same thing. If he takes damage from an attack from us or our, our, our allies, uh, he's going to get that whole boost card thing. Uh, which, by the way, just happened. And he's got 18 health now. Um, yeah, all ready. And we'll throw away Crushing Blow, because that's what we do as Hulk. Get four cards, Bounce Rage, a Get Ready, another Get Ready, <laughs> another Get Ready, great, wonderful. All right, one threat goes on the main scheme. Venom is going to attack us for two. We're actually going to block with Maria Hill. So this isn't going to happen because that's when damage goes to identity. We'll block with Maria. So he's coming. In, oh, sorry. So two plus three, four, five, six, seven. She gets knocked out. Uh, we'll get our encounter card, which is going to be two because of the hazard icon. Remove two chime counts from bell tower, so that goes away. So it's quiet side, so we take a damage. Our next encounter card, he's angry again. And he's got his overkill back. Okay. Ant-Man is going to attack for two to knock the tough off. Uh, which doesn't trigger anything because the tough prevented all the damage. We will then 
do a get ready to put in Boundless Rage, giving Hulk plus one attack. We're then going to attack for four. Unfortunately, we don't have that ring anymore, but we hit Venom for four. We attacked and dealt damage, so we get this. But we remove one counter from here and we take four off here. And we'll throw away our get readies. All ready up. Ant Man's still around because of the Honorary Avenger. Giving him a plus one hit point. And we'll get four cards. We have Strength in Numbers, Limitless Strength, Honorary Avenger, and Hawkeye. Great. At least it's something I can do. Having said that, I'll probably now get my uh, obligation and lose a couple of cards. All right. One threat on here. Venom is going to attack. It's got overkill, so we are just going to probably take it. We've got 21 health. So it's coming for three plus four, five, six. There it was. Six and put the enraged symbiote engaged with you. So we take six damage. Things down to 15. We retaliate for one. Unfortunately, it doesn't trigger these because these have to be damage, damage from an attack. Uh, Rage Simbi is going to hit us for two. We will retaliate on him for one. He's also got guard and patrol. So put those in to remind me. Then we get our encounter cards. Fighting Retort. Venom activates against you. Each boost card turned face up during this activation gets plus one boost. So he's coming in, he's attacking us for three plus. Uh, if this activation is an attack, this gets plus two boost icons for his attack and gains overkill. So we've got to count that as four, right? So he's coming in for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So he's down to six. We retaliate for one. Next card is Lashing Out. It's going to put an acceleration icon on the play. Comes in with nine. And again, any amount of damage done to Venom removes an equal amount of threat from there. From an attack. All right. We're going to do three resources. Put in Hawkeye. He'll come in with his four arrow counters. So whenever a uh, minion display, we can remove one of them and deal two damage to them. Would have been good if you were here earlier. Uh, he will attack for one to knock out this enraged symbiote. So we get over the guard and patrol. He'll take a consequential. What are we doing with Bruce over here? We're actually going to do a strength in numbers on Ant Man just to see what we get. If we pull this up. So, Wonder Man, that helps us, doesn't help us at all. We'll throw an Ori Avenger on Hawkeye. We will attack for four. On Venom, which is going to remove the now we're angry. Going to be four damage to take out Tooth and Nail. And four off that. We get one of these. We're going to throw a Wonder Man. I know we're only on six health, but we are going to stay up because he doesn't have his overkills anymore. So we can block with Ant-Man and hope we, we do all right with getting... Stuff from our card draw. Hulk Smash would be great. Hulk Smash would be wonderful if we, since we're going to reset the deck. All right, we'll draw our one card here, which is Team Training. Get another encounter card. This one's our one on our identity. Uh, 
All right, get three more cards. We have Banner's Lab. That's not what we want. Thunderclap. Hulk Smash. Are you kidding me? Okay. We just need things to work out. So, we're going to get three threat on the main. Sorry, three threat? No. Two threat. What am I talking about? Two more threat in the main because of the acceleration. Venom is going to attack us. We are going to block with Ant Man. So he's coming in with two plus three, four. Put the Enraged Simbi engage with you, but we'll trigger one of Hawkeye's arrows to get rid of that. Ant Man gets knocked out. Uh, then we'll get our encounter cards. When we'll search the encounter deck, this card pile set aside area of removing the game for a copy of your obligation, then reveal it. During that if you change alter ego form, discard one random card from your hand. This is terrible. All right, I'm sure I saw it come out earlier. All right. If so, we have to change the alter ego. We lose boundless rage. Um, because that we discard one random card from our hand. That is lab. And then we get to discard two cards from our hand. Wonderful. It's not really going to well. Our plan is now to try and survive the scheming for a round and hawk smash on the next turn. Next card, scan upgrade or support you control. That'd be the honorary Avenger. Attached to the villain, after the villain takes any amount of damage from the attack, give them one face down boost card. If they attack out three or more damage, the attached villain discard this card. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh wait, no, that did go up by three because no, it didn't. I'm I'm counting too much. Let me move this here, so no. All right, we're going to cover four. Hawkeye's going to thwart one. And then we're going to stay down and hope he doesn't scheme too much. Four more cards. We have Crushing Blow, Mockingbird, Genius, and Suborbital Leap. Okay. Two threat on the main. Venom schemes for two plus nothing. Thank goodness. Seven. Uh, get our counter card. We go change the hero form, the villain attacks you. That is fine. So we can attacks us for two plus put the engage symbol engage with you. Uh, that's not as good, but that's fine. So he's going to attack us for two. We are going to retaliate for one. After he takes any amount of damage from attacks, so that's not going to trigger. Okay. It is fine though because we will then spend three physical resources for a Hulk smash. Dealing, well, in fact, we could also just done this to get rid of him with Hawkeye's arrow. And then we'll just do 13 damage to Venom. Defeating him. Ha! Huh. There you have it. Hulk's strongest one there is with a bit of help from some allies doing some thwarting. Uh, but once again, Venom is, uh, has been defeated. This all happens, but it's not going to matter because he's defeated. This would have also gone away from all that damage. Um, but yeah, uh, pretty solid game. Uh, got a little worried at the end there with uh, getting my obligation triggered uh, through, what was that, what was that horrible card? Was it Loose Ends? 
and was loose end. So I didn't have to worry about it once it was gone. Uh, but yeah, if you like this content, make sure you um, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.